Hey guys, how's it going today? Uh, if you don't already know me, my name is Sheena, and thank you guys again for watching my channel. I know, you know, I've been away for a little bit again. <laughs> um, I kind of got sick, and I kind of needed to be with the family. Just a lot of stuff happened, and I just needed to take time. And I know I'm horrible with excuses, so that's my excuse. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but actually, yeah, like, things are just kind of crazy with the family right now. And I finally found time to film, and my body's been on and off with night shift and day shift, so... I'm trying to just recycle myself and I'm back and I'm doing this. I'm going to Vegas in a week so I'm pre-filming videos for that. Um, so yeah, I promise you two videos a week will be starting again soon. And uh, yeah, so <laughs> or I'm just going to shut up and we can get right into what we came here for. So today we're doing my May Boxy Charm. I did want to do this a little bit earlier but my box did come late. So that was a disappointment, but you know, we're going to try a little bit something different. You may notice that I don't have any makeup on today. So I'm going to actually do a first impressions on my May Boxy Charm, and I'm going to go in and I am going to test out these products onto my face. So it is already open because I wanted to see what was in it, so I know what's not to wear. So I just started, decided to just do a bare face today because most of this stuff is face products in here. So if you like to see what my first impressions are of my May box charm, then just keep on watching. So I'm still trying to figure out my filming situation. Um, this is kind of the best I can do at the moment. I am in my bedroom at my parents' place, um, and I do want to give you guys a bedroom tour, but I am moving again in August, so me and my boyfriend have finally decided to move in together, and we're actually waiting for the house to be built. So um, that will hopefully be August, September-ish. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I do want to give you guys like a bedroom tour, but it's so messy and it's so cramped in here because of my filming stuff and then my bed is big and then this desk kind of takes up a lot of room. So I don't know if I'm going to do that. I did just decorate, um, but it's kind of packed in here. Like I have a bookcase, another shelf there, a dresser. It's too small of a room for how much shit I have to be completely honest. But that's okay because I just am here for the summer and then I'm moving and I'm so excited and me and my boyfriend will officially have a house and it's kind of scary but kind of exciting at the same time but I'm really excited to take the new step with him. Also if you guys want to meet my boyfriend video let me know because I'm trying to convince him and he's kind of down for it so if you guys want that let me know. Alright so <laughs> back to the whole box of charm thing. The first thing in this box of charm was this crown brush. And also the theme of the box this month is makeup is art. Um, and again, that's just the card. The card's really pretty today. I like this one. Ooh. I'm also an art. Well, I went to school for art, so I'm kind of into that. So the round contour brush is $24.99 um, by Crown Pro. It's a soft powder brush that can be used liquid, powder, or any cream product to full coverage application. So we're going to put that to test. So I'm going to apply my foundation. I kind of like how it has a case on it. So we're going to try it. Ooh. These are soft. So I bought these like cheaper ones from um, Amazon and they're more dense. Alright, so for primer I'm going in with my Milani Prime Light. Okay, so I'm going to just mix some of my Fit Me foundations because I am such not pale anymore and all I have is pale foundations so <laughs> yeah I'm getting foundation everywhere oh my god you guys I am such a mess I'm gonna try so what I like to hold I like to hold my finger here and kind of just brush with it circular motions so it's not giving me a streaky texture like those other ones usually do. I like how small this is too because you can kind of really get into all those nooks. Like right here by my nose, it's really easy by my eyes. First impression, I actually do quite enjoy this brush for foundation. is isn't leaving it streaky at all, which is so nice because, like, again, these brushes I got off Amazon, like, they're so streaky. And I just keep them on my desk because they're rose gold, and I'm trying to do the whole rose gold and white theme. All right, so I'm just going to put on some of my Naked Skin Concealer. So 
So I do not like this brush for concealer. <laughs> To be completely honest, I do not like it. It kind of just, it does make your concealer a little bit streaky. I think it's because it's just like a thicker, like it is just a thicker cream. So I think that's why it's more harder to use. Another product that I got in the box is this Time 2 BoxyCharm Highlighter. It's a liquid glow. So this retails for... $29.50. You can put this in with your foundation, which I should have tried and I didn't, but we're going to put it on our cheekbones and we're going to try it like that. So I'm going to just use this with a sponge and now I'm just going to pour some of this onto the back of my hand. It already exploded a little bit in the cap, so that's cool. So it's kind of like a, this is going to be so pretty for summer, but it's like a bronzy champagne-y shade. So I'm just going to tap this onto my high points and I'm just going to go with the Beauty Blender. So it gives off a really, really pretty shine. It's not like my favorite liquid highlighter, but it does give off a really pretty shine. Hmm. My entire face is really dewy right now, so I'm going to go and set my face now. When my face is all set, I used a matte face powder, and you know what? Like that highlighter is doing really good because it's still shining through, and that makes me extremely happy. So the next thing that we got in this box is a highlighting contour palette by IBY, I believe. IBY Beauty. I wish I knew what that meant. I got in something, I got in an eyeshadow palette from this brand before. I found my boxy charm. It was so good. It was so pigmented. It was amazing. Um, so the highlighting contour palette retails for $40. So what we are going to do now is, alright, so we open up the contour palette and it looks like this. So it kind of looks like Anastasia. It has a mirror which is really really nice. I will be using that. So it has a mirror. There's this plastic cover on it. Alright so I'm going to go take the... actually I want to swatch these first. Alright they are super pigmented. <laughs> Let's try the bottom shades. So those are very pigmented, and I really like how you have like kind of a neutral shade, a warm shade, and a cool shade. That's awesome. So you can kind of customize, mix it your own. So I'm going to go and I'm going to take highlight two, and I'm going to set my under eyes. So I'm just taking highlight two here, and I'm just going to set. There is a lot of kickoff off of these products, but they do look really good under the eyes. So there is a lot of kickoff, but I'm okay with that. But yeah, they look really good under the eyes. Alright, so I'm going to take shade, I think I'm going to do contour one, and I'm just going to contour my cheekbones. I'm just going to go with contour too and do a little bit of my forehead. Kind of just warm up the skin. I am not disappointed by this at all. This is really, really nice. So I'm definitely going to play around with this a lot more. I feel like I did want a new contour palette too, so that's kind of handy that that came in. I do wish this shade was a little bit more yellow and that these two shades were like different. They kind of look the same. This one is more pinky tone. This one is more yellow tone, but I just wish they were more like dominant kind of colors. And I do wish this shade was a little bit more cool tone. But other than that, it's actually a really nice little compact palette. 
very last couple of products from this box this month are these two things that they do go together. So this is the Convertible Brow 02 by The Brow Gal. It retails for $35 and it also comes with a brush. And the brush retails for $14 from Brow Gal. So I don't know how I'm going to feel about this brush. It is really flimsy. I do like more of a stiff bristle kind of brush. But alright. Oh, this is actually really nice. Okay. So this is what it looks like. So there is three shades in it, which is awesome. There's a darker shade, which obviously I need. And this middle shade I will probably definitely be using for my inner brow. This shade is a little bit too red for me, but when I do go hunt, my hair kind of does change color in the summertime. It does go a little bit more ginger, so probably when it comes into this I can mix these, which will be really nice. So, um, I am going to go in and I'm going to attempt this. So I'm going to try to use this mirror, so I'm just using the back of the spilly here. Just combing through my brows. I'm actually pretty impressed with this. The brush is a little bit too flimsy for me. I just, I'm addicted to my Anastasia one. That thing works like magic. But honestly, like, I'm not disappointed. It is a little bit hard to kind of carve out, like, the tips of your brows. But I'm not mad. Not at all mad. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to do the rest of my makeup and I will be back for my final review and all that good stuff. As my final verdict of this month's box is I actually am very, very impressed with it. Um, I kind of like how they changed it up this time. They added like a brush with the contour palette and then a brush with the eyebrow palette and then added like an entire face too because they added like a liquid highlighter that you could do so many versatile things with. So you know what? I'm actually not really disappointed. I really do like this palette. I absolutely am kind of really happy with this to be completely honest. I actually really do like the eyebrow stuff too. The color is perfect for me which makes me really happy because my hair is constantly changing so it's super nice that there's a like an eyebrow palette that literally needs all three shades that I need. So I'm really happy. I'm really satisfied with this. The brush, um... I could live without it, to be completely honest. I usually use a beauty blender anyways, but this is really nice for foundation. Some of those thicker foundations, this is really nice to use, or I like those thinner ones even. They kind of, like, they just work better with a brush than they do with, like, a sponge, let's say. So this will come in handy, and I do like it a lot more than those ones that I got off Amazon, so that's a little bit more satisfying too. Um, the Tem 2, I really want to try this in my foundation for a more dewy, glowy look. So I'm really excited to try that. Um, I'm not disappointed by it at all. The only thing I'm really disappointed by is the brush, the eyebrow brush. Um, the bristles are just too flimsy for me. I'm just not a big fan of it. Um, so I will take a pass on this one, but every other product is kind of nice a little bit to have in your collection to kind of just go forward and move forward with new products. So I'm really enjoying all of these. So the total of this month's box is $143.49, which is an insane price. So it's almost $150 worth of product, which is unbelievable. That's such a good deal. For $30 a month I pay for this, like, this is just an amazing deal. Like, honestly, guys, I will leave a link below. I am not affiliated at all with BoxChair. I do may not make any commission off this. I'm just literally in love with this service. This is the best subscription box I have tried. I've tried so many, and I've canceled, like, three, and this is the only one that I've kept. So, honestly, guys... Give it a shot. If, if the beauty of box term is you can cancel it any time, like that's the beauty of it. So I would definitely recommend to give this box a shot. All right, guys. If you like my video, thank you again for watching. Um, make sure you like my channel and subscribe for more videos. I do post twice a week. Uh, so that is all I got for you guys today. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs>